Okay, I'm just doing a video on putting together the Stuka and the Messerschmitt. These are my uh, Lindbergh models. And where's the cover? I just had the cover. They're basically these two kits. And I just want to show people how to, how, how to bring back the fun of just building a model kit without having to be an expert at it. Um, now, what happened to the box top? And so I'm just going to spend this video. We're just going to, I'm just going to put together this, this Messerschmitt. Okay. I'm just going to build a model. I already got the fuselage together. Okay. Get some good tester cement with a little fine tip on it. Where is the package top? Oh my goodness gracious. I think I'm going to lose my mind. I just, oh, here it is. So this is the kit. We've got these, we just got these at Young's Professor, or Professor Tinker's, Pro Tinker Toys. It's item number HL508. You get the Stuka and the Messerschmitt. And I'm just going to put together the Messerschmitt. I'm not going to, I'm going to cut the flak off. You want to kind of chip the flak off after you, now what is flak? Flak is the part that is connected to the plastic right here. That's what you want to always cut off because it will, it will help you make the model a little bit more smoother, okay? So you always want to chip that off. See this right here? See that right there? That's the little flat. And you want to cut that off. It helps you put together the pieces better. All right. So let's get the prop together. Let's put a little bit of oil or, or glue right here. We don't want it to stick. I think I got a little too much, but see like right here, you see the flak right here? You see the flak right there? Let me get the good picture on it. So you guys understand what flak is. Flak is this, now let's see here. Let me get a good, see that flak right there? Right there. And that's what you want to cut off like that, just like that. So it's nice and flat. Okay. All right. There we go. All right, so the next part is so we're on part one, part two. We did part two. Now part three is the crew and their seats. So their seats. Ah. And then I'll I'll show you after I build it. I show you I'll show you how to airbrush it to make it look kind of cool. All right. So we need their seats. Got one and two. They're machine gun. We need a machine gun. Number 18. They're machine gun. And the two crew. Right here. And there's a lot of flack on these guys. Let me show you what real flack is. Okay. You see that right there? Boy, this camera stinks. Where is this lens? You see that right there? That flak right there. And then this part right here is flak. That's terrible. It's just not in focus. Hmm. So we'll cut all this off.
Cut that off. Can you not block, drop things? <sighs> I gotta pick it up. I drop things so much from putting things together. All right, now. So let's glue the pilot into his chair. Get his other chair. fun is just putting things together that's what I've, I as a kid I just love to put things together and so I would just put them together there I dropped it again I mean can I ever make something without dropping it for the love of Mike now where did that go I can't believe it oh come on see this is what happens when you get older you, you lose your, 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 your ability to do something. Pretty soon I'll... Now, where is that machine gun? This has got to be a joke. It's, it always drops somewhere where you don't expect it to be. It, it always. It always drops somewhere where you don't expect it to be. And I don't have any idea where it is. There it is. Okay. All right. Unbelievable. All right, so I got the glue in there. It's probably already dried. Wrong location. It's a machine. Rear machine gun placement. Okay. Now we'll put each one of the pilots in. This was what was so fun as a kid. Just put put the model kit together. I've got so many model kits I haven't put together because oh, I've got to be perfect. It has to be perfect. It has to be perfect, Brian. Perfect. No, it doesn't. It's part of the fun is putting the dumb thing together. Okay, now the cot. Now we need the canopy. The canopy is one big piece. Where's the canopy? Right here. So we're gonna put a nice bead of glue. What's really cool about this is it's a really fine tip. And you can put your glue right where you want it. See that? Already that looks cool. Okay, so we got that. Now we're going to do the tail fins. See how fun this is? 
Okay, so now we got the tail fin, and we'll cut that off. Now we got to cut the flak off, make sure there's no flak. And we'll shave it off of here. And then we'll put some, drop some glue on it. And we're gonna glue it right here. All right, now we have the fuse lodge. Okay, now we'll do the wings. I've got this part of wing done. Now we'll glue it. And then the Arion. These are what's cool. Look at that. Isn't that the detail? You know, Lindbergh, people like to knock Lindbergh for their model kits, but, you know, for the money you pay for a Lindbergh kit, it's a fun kit to put together. And I bought a bunch of these at a great price. I've got tank, I mean, tanks. I've got uh, ships. I've got airplanes. I've got a half track. Um, you know, just build and put one of these on your layout. There, there's the wing. Okay. Oh, this thing's coming together. It's coming together. Look at that. See, and then as a kid, you could run around the house with your airplane. You don't care what it's painted like. It's just build it with your kid. Have fun putting it together. That's part of the fun. How's it coming out? Is that good video? Yeah, okay, good. All right, so now we're moving on to the other wing. We got to put both wings on, but I'll glue this one on first. Glue this on here. And sometimes when you're sticking it, now this is what you can be nitpicky on or you don't have to be, but of getting the glue on correctly. Sometimes you put too much on. All right, so now we have the other wing. Let's make sure all the flak. And we'll do some glue here. And we're going to put in this in the in Professor Tink or in ProTinkerToys.com. We're going to put this in the front of the store so kids can see it. Because I'm going to put every one of these model kits together. We're going to do a video of every one of these model kits. So people can see what they look like put together. Not super detailed, just what they look like. So your kid, if you got a 10-year-old or a 9-year-old, you could put this together. Look at this, watch. 
Check that out. Of course, now we got to get the tail, tail fin in on there. Oh, this is so cool. Okay, so we got that on. Now we have to put on the, um, the machine guns. They go right here. One, two, three. One, two, three. All right, the machine guns are, let's see, 31, oh my gosh, those are so tiny. Holy moly. Man, that is tiny. Let's see, 31 goes right here. See that? 31 is a machine gun. All right, maybe it might be an antenna. All right, and then we got... 31 and 32, which are just dots. I'll cut those off with the blade. Now, I bought some tweezers. Let me go get my tweezers. You can get this stuff at um, Hobby Lobby, not Hobby Lobby, at, um, uh, what do you call it? Um, far, uh, God, Harbor Freight. You can get a ton of stuff at Harbor Freight. They got tweezers. They have all the cool stuff that you would need building a model. All right, so we got the machine guns in. Isn't that cool? All right, so we got that done. Now we've got the landing gear. So we got the wheels. Oh, this thing's going to move, too. It's going to roll. Oh, cool. Oh, the kids will have fun with this, with the army men that they might have. We got army men we sell. Plus, we got tanks. We got... Uh, you, they could create a battle. Oh, this is so cool. All right, so we need both of these. These are the wheels. All right, so we're going to put these together. And we're going to put the wheel in it. So we're going to put the frame first. Let's glue up the frame. We're going to lay the wheel in there because we want the wheel to move. Right, guys? Put that together. There we go. All right, so the wheel is together. That one's going to glue together. We'll let that glue dry. Then we'll get the other component. Put the wheel in there. We'll cut off the flat. There's some flack here that needs to be cut off. I'll cut it off after I connect them to. Okay, so we have the two landing gears. Uh-oh, that came off. That's okay. The glue will dry this really quick. Check that out. You like my special effects? I know you do. Everybody does. I don't know a lot about anything, but I know a lot about everything. That's my new quote. 
So if you don't know it, that's Brian Young's quote. I don't know a lot about anything, but I know a lot about everything. Okay. I know how to do a lot of things. I'm not an expert in anything. You don't need to be an expert in anything. Just as long as you can do a lot of things. Look at that. Look at that. That airplane is so cool. Check that out. Okay, now we got we got the landing gear so we can set this guy down now. Let those landing gear dry. Okay, so now we got the bomb racks. We got the, oh, we got bombs. Oh, cool. We're going to put bombs on this thing. Oh, sweet. Uh-oh. We got the bombs. And then we got it. We're gonna put a bomb on it. Where are the big bombs? Where are the big bombs? Where are they? Where are they? Okay, we got big bombs. Where are the big bombs? Uh oh. Oh, here they are. Oh, a big bomb. Check that big bomb out. Okay, let's cut the flak off of that. Cut the flak off. Put a little bit of glue on that. And it's going to go into the bomb uh, area. Oh, cool. Look at that bomb rack release. So they would drop that, and it would fly right over and drop the bombs. Then they've got small bombs. Okay, so that goes there. This is the rear fin. This was supposed to go on for oh I see yeah it wasn't I didn't look at the instructions good enough uh -huh, good thing I didn't really put that together let that dry I should have put this on first so that goes on this way A flak. See, that's the thing. A flak is basically, uh, and they're from old molds. You get more flak from older molds. But you know what? If you're just trying to have fun putting together a model kit, good grief, who cares? You can make if if, if you're good at modeling, you could turn this kit into a into a, an expert kit. And all this is a kid. He's gonna set that on his dresser and look at that and go, Dad, look at this model I put together. Okay, so now we need the tail wheel, wheel, the tail wheel. That goes on the back. So we're going to put that right here. All right, that's cool. All right, now we have the bomb racks. Let's put together the bombs. And we need four bomb racks. So we're going to glue the four bomb racks here. 
one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And we're going to put the bottom racks in. One. Two, and then we'll put a bomb on there. I remember doing this. Oh, I used to love putting models together. And I just would, I would put so many models together. I must have had model uh, uh, 55 Bel Airs. I must have had 25 of them put together. I just, they had doors that would open, the trunks would open. Uh, I just thought they were the coolest thing. Then we moved and my mom threw them all away because she thought they had broken pieces. Tell me about it, how traumatic that was to me, a child traumatic okay so now these are your air 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 arions so we'll put a dot of blue here here and here see that <laughs> Isn't that sweet? Check out that airplane. And this kit is only 12 bucks, I think, or, or 50. It's, it's under 20 bucks. You don't get one, you get two airplanes. I mean, good grief. Where can you find that kind of deal? Only at ProTinkerToys.com. ProTinkerToys.com. Let's see here. I think there's a hole supposed to be here. Yep. That was supposed to be a hole. And the mold obviously is old. All right. I lost my alien right here. I'm gonna have to glue that again. I know there's I know this glue is not dried yet. It should that glue should dry. This once it's dried, it should never come off. Alright. Now this goes here. Now, I need to pull this apart because I didn't put this piece in right. This needs to go right here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Glue's not completely dried yet, so I can still pull this apart. There we go. There we go.
Okay, we gotta put the bomb thing back on. Oh, the bomb thing broke. Oh, shoot. Oh, dang it. All right, now we need the Vs. Okay, those are the supports. Wing support. Rear, rear aileron, air, ailerons need to be strutted in. Okay, we got the bombs on, we got the rear wheel, we got everything on, and we got to redo the bomb thing. That came apart because I had to re-glue the airplane because I forgot the front uh, radiator. But that is the Stuka. Okay, it comes in a two-pack. It's the uh, Junkers... JU87 Stuker dive bomber. Okay, and then you get also the Messerschmitt, which that's going to be the next video, is the Messerschmitt. It comes in a two pack HL508. HL508. And this is the Stuka, baby. The Stuka bomber. Give this to your five year old, 10 year old, 10 year old, really. And say, put it together. I want to see you what how a model looks. And then let him put this on his dresser. Because that's what he's going to do. He's going to set this on his dresser. And then at night, he's going to go... Nyeom. All right? And that is the Stuka. What do you think, guys? Pretty cool? And we're going to do videos on all 20 model kits that we have. Plus, we're going to do them on cars, everything. Just like this. We're not going to do super detail. I'm just going to put them together, baby. This has got rolling wheels. There we go, the Stuka.